<laughs> I'm a cute puppy. Woof! And I'm a sweet kitten. <laughs> the kitten's gonna catch the puppy. <laughs> Kittens can't catch puppies. Is that so? <laughs> woof! Woof! Hey <laughs> oh, wow! <laughs> now you can catch me, Bebe. <laughs> the little kitten has grown up, Pepe. I can do anything I want. Nothing can stop me. Good for you, Bebe. I didn't know you could run so fast. Well, now you know. <laughs> Stop it, Copus! <laughs> Don't lick my face! <laughs> oh, my cutie pie! Oh. I think they're hungry, Pepe! Oh. See, she said yes! Oh, their bowls are empty! Maybe they're thirsty! <laughs> Copus said yes, too! I'll go get some right away! Be patient, my little animal friends! Pepe's gone to get you some food and water! <laughs> oh. What is it, Pepe? Oh, Shushu, you know, we have a little kitten and a cute puppy. Yes. When they're hungry, we give them food, and when they're thirsty, we give them water. But the streets are crawling with stray cats and dogs. How do they find food when they're hungry? Where do they get water when they're thirsty? They try to find everything by themselves. Most of the time, to get some food, they search the trash cans for leftovers. <laughs> Water is an even bigger problem in hot weather. So they live in very difficult conditions, Bebe. Oh, but that's so sad, Shushu. I'm back. Here you go, little ones. What's the matter, Bebe? You seem upset. Well, Pepe, we've given food and water to our kitten and puppy, but what about all the other animals living in the streets? And it's been so hot nowadays. Oh, you're right, Bebe. Wait, Mommy's told me to go buy some bread. I'll be back in no time. All right, Pepe. <laughs> what a beautiful day. La, 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 la. The flowers and the beetles are all so beautiful. <laughs> La 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 la, lady, my lady, you never rest for me. La la la, I've been beating myself up. La 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 la, my lady. Here, la, la. Kitty, 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 oh? kitty, 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 kitty. Oh, come here, little kitty cats. I brought you some food and water. Here you go. <laughs> come over here. Don't be shy. Oh. <laughs> Enjoy it, my cuties. Whoa! Huh? Come here, my sweeties. Your friend Zeze has brought you some food and water. <laughs> <laughs> Zeze, my child, what are you doing here? <laughs> I brought some food for the cats, Mr. Grocer. Oh, but I have no water left. That's not a problem, my child. Here! <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Grocer. It's a very kind thing that you're doing, my dear Zeze. Every day I try to feed stray cats and dogs whenever I can. I also leave bowls filled with water for them, too. Yes, Mr. Grocer. If we're not here to give them food and water, how could they survive in this hot weather? Those poor little things. Well done, my child. <laughs> oh, did you happen to see Pepe? He hasn't been around today. Hello, Mr. Grocer. Hey, Zeze. How do you do, Pepe? Yippee! Hello. Oh, Pepe, I was just asking about you, and there you are. Speaking of the honey bunny. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a little honey bunny. <laughs> hey, Zeze, what is you're carrying on your bike? I'm giving food and water to the dogs and the cats that I see on the street. That's very nice. Zeze is a very good person, isn't she, Mr. Grocer? <laughs> yes, indeed, she is a good person, Pepe. Oh, Zeze, it's so hot today. <sighs> yes, Pepe, it's really very hot. Hello, children. Hi, Shushu. How do you do, Shushu? Zeze, you're very kind to do what you're doing. These animals who live on the streets can't always find food and water during these very hot days. It's very nice of you to help them like you do. Thanks, Shushu. In the summertime, my mom and I always put Put some water bowls all around the street and fill them up every day so the dogs and cats in the neighborhood are never thirsty or in need of water. 
That's very nice, Zeze. And in the wintertime, we build cardboard boxes as shelter for stray dogs with my dad. Wow! Yes, Pepe. And to protect them from the rain, we cover them with plastic bags. We make a little door to let them in, and then they could take shelter from the rain. Wow, that's excellent thinking. Street animals should be very cold in the winter season. I'll tell Daddy, and we'll help you next time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very proud of you kids. Then you could sing a very very nice song for us, Shushu. Yes, let's sing and dance together. Please, Shushu. All right, then. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Cats and dogs always on the streets all alone. Pepe and Zeze help them on their own. They seem so lonesome when living out there. Pepe and Bebe give them love and care. Cats and dogs and dogs and cats in the neighborhood. They need a bowl of water and a yummy plate of food. Cats and dogs and dogs and cats in the neighborhood. They need a bowl of water and a yummy plate of food. Cats and dogs always on the streets all alone. Pepe and Zeze help them on their own. Cats and dogs and dogs and cats in the neighborhood. They need a bowl of water and a yummy plate of food. Cats and dogs always on the streets all alone. Pepe and Zeze help them on their own. Cats and dogs and dogs and cats in the neighborhood. They need a bowl of water and a yummy plate of food. Cats and dogs and dogs and cats in the neighborhood. They need a bowl of water and a yummy plate of food. Mr. Grocer, my mommy asked for two loaves of bread. Uh, don't you want the paper as well, Pepe? Ah, uh, yes, of course I do, <laughs> sir. <laughs> Here it is. <laughs> Thanks, Mr. Grocer. You're welcome, son. <laughs> I should get this all back to my mom. I'll be back with food and water, okay? Excellent, Pepe! <laughs> <laughs> what took you so long? I'm back, Pepe. I saw Zeze. Remember you were talking about all the street animals? Wondering how they could find food and water? Yes? She was giving them food and water. Huh? All of them, all the cats and dogs were all following her around. Oh, that's very nice. We should do the same, Pepe. All right, take these to Mommy. Oh, you've also bought the newspaper? Can you ask Mommy for some leftovers, Pepe? I'm going to get some water. Wait, why is it me who has to do all this, Pepe? Oh, what's the problem? Nothing, nothing, no problem. I'll do as you say. <laughs> hey, Grandma. Pepe, it's too hot today, don't you think so? Yes, Grandma, it's very hot. You can't imagine how thirsty I am. What are you doing, my child? We'll put some bowls filled with water all around the streets. The animals that live there are very thirsty as well. But I've got two bowls. Well, good for you, my child. It's very <laughs> kind of you. I may have another bowl for you. Look, here it is. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Pepe? Oh, hello, Grandma. Hello, my child. Look at all the food Mommy gave me. She said cats and dogs would eat it. <laughs> But she told me to put them on the sides and not get the street dirty. Oh, great, Bebe. Let's go then. See you, Goodbye, Grandma. my little children. Goodbye. Zeze. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Pepe. Bebe. Hello, Zeze. How do you do, Bebe? Look, we brought plenty of food and water. Awesome. I've already put enough over here. So let's go over there. All right, then. <laughs> <laughs> I think that should be enough. <laughs> Look at all those cats and dogs eating the food and drinking the water that we brought them. <laughs> They're all so cute. Oh, here's my little kitten. Does they meet my little kitten? What? What is it, little kitten? Oh, kitty, are you upset? What's wrong, my lovely kitten? I 
It thinks she was jealous because you were with the other kitties. But I love you so much too, little kitten. Come here on my lap, cutie pie. <laughs> <laughs> my sweet little kitten. <laughs> Hello, Lily. Hello, Liko. <laughs> what an awesome thing that is, Liko. Thank you, Lily. Where did you buy it? My father bought it. Yeah. Well, what is it called? Should I call it a bicycle or a car? It's not a car. What is it, Liko? It's a scooter. A scooter? Yes, you push it with your foot. Ah, you push it with your foot and it goes. Yes, exactly. It is very nice. Can I ride it too, Liko? Of course, come. But you may not be able to ride it at first. It takes some practice. Yeah, I can ride it. Ah! I don't want to say I told you, but I told you so, Lily. But you ride it so well. Why can't I do it like you? I wasn't able to do it at first either. I told you, it takes some practice. How will I get used to it? I will hold you like this. Until you learn to maintain your balance, you will do some practice trying to push when I'm holding. That's really all it should take. Oh, okay. Come on, hold it. Okay, push it slowly with huh? one foot. Like this? Yes, like that. <laughs> I'm doing it. But don't look at your feet. Look in front of you, Lily. Or huh? you'll fall again when I let go. Okay, I will push with my feet while looking in front of me. Yes, just like that. Ay. Push, don't worry, Lily, push. Haha, -ha, it's great. See, look, you're doing it. Haha, <laughs> wonderful, I did it. <laughs> <laughs> Good for you, Lily. You learned it very fast. It's so much fun, Liko. <laughs> <laughs> ah, Lily, Liko. Hello, Kulaboos. Hello, Kulaboos. What a lovely scooter you have, Lily. It's Liko's scooter, Kulaboos. He taught me how to ride it. If you want, I can teach you, Kulaboos. Okay, but I came to play a game. Ah, uh, yes, then. Let's play a game. Okay, then what will we play, Kulaboos? Okay, then. The game is loading now. <laughs> <laughs> What is it, Kulaboos? It's a great game, Lily. The Witch Job, Witch Vehicle Game. Witch Job, Witch Vehicle Game? Yes, it's a very exciting game. What is a job, Kulaboos? A job is what a person does for a living after receiving the required training for it, friends. For example, teaching is a job. Engineering, captains, doctors. They're all jobs. Aha, I got it now. Then how will we play the which job, which vehicle game, Kulaboos? Ha, let me tell you. What does a vehicle mean, friends? Hmm, well... They are used to carry or transport people, animals, or things. Am I right? Yes, Kulaboos. Buses, trucks, cars. Airplanes, ships, trains, they are all vehicles, aren't they, Kulaboos? Yes, exactly. <laughs> Come with me. <laughs> we will play today's game in the game forest. Wow. <laughs> this is such a wonderful place, Kulaboos. What is a forest, Kulaboos? The place where many trees grow and live together is a forest. This here is the game forest in our game village. I didn't know such a forest existed in our game village. Me neither. There are many things we have not seen in our game village, Lely. Oh, beautiful. Very exciting. <laughs> now, there are game boards in this forest hidden behind the trees. First, you need to find a game board. There are pictures on the game boards. You'll see a picture of a job on each board. For example, a captain who sails a ship. How many boards are we supposed to find, Kulaboos? You'll find one, and Lily will find another. Ah, oh, hee! Then Kulaboos, then what? You will see pictures of three vehicles under the picture of the job. For example, bicycle, minibus, ship. 
You'll need to find which vehicle a captain uses for their job. And then press the done button. Is that right, Kulaboo? Yes, friends. You got it. We get it. Hooray. Welcome, welcome. You are welcome, welcome, welcome. You are welcome. We saw it, thought and found it. We saw it, thought and found it. Welcome, welcome. You are welcome, welcome, welcome. You are welcome. We saw it, thought. When you press the dirt <laughs> button, if you choose the correct vehicle, all the trees in the game forest will do a dance with you. What? The trees are going to dance? Yes, and they will also change colors. Can trees actually <laughs> dance, Kulaboos? In normal life, they can't, but here in our game village, everything is possible, Liko. It sounds like lots of fun. <laughs> Let's start, Kulaboos. I'm so excited. Come on. Then I am starting the countdown to go to the game forest. Are you ready? Yes! And three, two, one, start! I started the timer! Ay, this is such a nice place, Liko. Yes, Lily, aren't those trees lovely? Ooh. Come on, time is running out. Look for the boards. Ay, we have to find the game board, Liko. Come, come, I think I can see a board there. Where is it? Look, it's here. I found it, I found it. Aha! What was the word for this? These people who go and extinguish fires and they help out all people and animals who are in emergency situations. What are they called, Lely? It's on the tip of my tongue. Oh, fireman, I found it. Yes, fireman. Hmm. Now let's see, which vehicle should our hero fireman ride? Should they ride in a bus, friends? No. <laughs> I also think it's not a bus. Buses are for normal passengers. Hmm. Ah, what was the name of this vehicle, friends? It was used by the farmers to plow the farms. Ay, what was its name? What was Tractor. it? Tractor! And tractors are for farmers, not for firemen. Um, Isn't that right? Yes, yes, it is! Aha! Of course! This is a fire truck. Look at it! It looks so cool! It carries water in it to extinguish fires. Yes, we found it, friends! This is the vehicle that firemen drive and ride in! <laughs> Time is running out. Ay, we forgot the timer. Press the button, Lily. Will the trees dance when we press the button now, Kulaboos? Yes, press and see, Lily. <laughs> I can't believe it. I can't believe it. This is amazing. <laughs> welcome, welcome. You are welcome, welcome, welcome. You are welcome. We saw it, thought it. Now let's find the next game board. Ah, oh, okay. Come on, Liko. There are no game boards around here. Not here either. Let's look some more. It's not here. Oh boy, it's not here. Well, where is the board, Kulaboos? I can't see it either. Let's keep looking. Huh? The tree touched me. Did you see that? I told you that everything is possible in this forest. Do you think... It's telling me to go that way? <laughs> yes! I wonder if the game board is there. Run, Liko, run! The board, I found Coming, it! Coming, Lily! Uh-uh! I wonder what job this man does. He is wearing a white coat. Hmm... What is that thing hanging around his neck? Uh-uh, oh, when I was sick, my parents took me to a doctor. And the doctor listened to my breathing with that tool around his neck. Aha, uh -huh, I know it. He's a doctor, Lely. Is that right, friends? Yes! I. what is the thing around his neck? What was it? It had a very funny name. A stethoscope! Yeah, a stethoscope. 
doctors listen to our heartbeats through it by making us breathe in and out. Haha! <laughs> Do you know what? I want to become a doctor when I grow up. Do you know what you want to be when you grow up? <laughs> yes! Haha! <laughs> Great! <laughs> We're running out of time. Come on! Five! Hey, okay, Kulaboos! Hmm, let's see which of these vehicles here does a doctor ride in. This is a truck, ha! Huh? Doctors don't ride in trucks. Trucks are for carrying heavy loads. Isn't that right, friends? Yes! Four! Uh, what was this called? It lifts up very heavy things. I. what was it called? It's a crane! Three! Of course, a crane! Good for you! But doctors do not ride in cranes. But this is an ambulance. Two. An ambulance is used to carry hurt and sick people. The doctor can ride in an ambulance. Is that right, friends? Yes. Oh. Hi, we forgot the time again. Press the button quick, Lika. I pressed it. Zero. <laughs> welcome, 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 welcome. You are welcome, welcome, welcome. You are welcome. We saw it. Goodbye! <laughs> she has such a lovely heart, she is busy busy. Hop, 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 Hello, Pissy. Hop. Hello, Juju. <laughs> You're hop, so good hop, at skipping hop, rope. <laughs> I love skipping rope. <laughs> My clip! My hair clip! Uh, my favorite hair clip! Ah! Uh, uh, uh. <sighs> my beautiful hair clip! <laughs> well done, Pissy! You didn't let your hairpin get away! You caught it! <laughs> <laughs> yes, I love my hairpin very much, Juju! Ah. What is it, Pissy? Juju? The metal piece that clips onto my hair is gone. <laughs> really? Oh no. I can't clip it in my hair like this. <sighs> huh? <sighs> it's such a small piece, it will be impossible to find in the grass. <laughs> I smell something. I think Black Crow is on his way. Blah! 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 I'm already here, Pissy! Blah! But why is my beautiful friend crying again? Blah! I'm so sad, Black Crow. Uh, but why is that? Look. Oh, what a lovely hairpin! <laughs> Why don't you wear it so that I can see how nice it looks on you? I can't, Black Crow. Oh, why? The wind took my hairpin right off just now, and the metal piece that clips onto my hair must have fallen off. It's lost somewhere now. Oh, really? Really. And it's so tiny that it'll be impossible to find, Crow. It may be difficult, but it is definitely not impossible, Pissy. Hmm. Ha! Just you wait and see, Pissy! Blah! My beautiful hairpin. If only I could find that metal piece so that I could wear you again. <laughs> What's this, Juju? <laughs> Wonderful! Of course! How did we not think of this? This is a magnet, Pissy. A magnet? Yes! What do I do with this magnet, Black Crow? A magnet pulls metal things towards itself! Blah! If the piece lost from your hair clip is made from metal then... If Pissy walks around holding the magnet over the grass... The magnet will pull the missing piece toward itself! Just like that! Blah! Oh, really? Yes, what? Black Crow is right. A magnet is a special object which pulls objects made of metal towards itself. Ah, hooray! Come on, find my beautiful hairpin. The magnet pulls the metal towards it. 
the missing piece is also metal. Fine, 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 fine. Pissy! Pissy! <laughs> I stop, Pan! I pissy! Oh. oh, Pan, you did it again! I pissy, I can never control myself when I'm going too fast. I'm very sorry. <laughs> Okay, okay, it's no problem. What happened this time? I have a problem, and this time it's a big problem. I don't think I can solve this problem. <laughs> if you don't tell me about it, we won't be able to solve it. Tell me, my friend. My mom was sewing a new dress for Pin. She always pins the dress with pins before sewing and keeps them in a sewing box. Pin secretly took my mom's box to play with, and inside she found hundreds, thousands of pins. Pin took the box to the woods to play, and when she opened it, the pins scattered everywhere. <laughs> she was able to pick up a few of them, but there are still hundreds on the ground. <laughs> oh, no. Those pins will harm both the soil and the creatures in the woods. We should pick them up right away, Pan. Yes, but how? I... I... What is that? Haha, <laughs> of course. This is a magnet, Pan. Huh? The metal piece of my hair clip is lost, and I have been looking for it with a magnet. How does it work? Huh? A magnet pulls metal things toward itself, Pan. Look, I hold it close to the ground like this, and... Huh? Ah, look! Huh? I found it! Did you see how it attached the piece to it? Ah, uh, do you think we can pick up all the pins scattered in the woods with this? Yes, we certainly can, Pan. <laughs> We've solved the problem, then. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let's go, Pan! <laughs> Where are you two going so quickly, Pissy? You're starting to make me very worried! <laughs> Pan's sister Pin accidentally dropped and scattered hundreds of metal pins in the woods and we're going to go pick them up, Black Crow. Come and help us if you'd like, Crow. Black Crow would like that, but only if Pan is okay. No matter what I do, he always seems to be mad with me! Corel is right, Pan. Why are you still being cold to him? Look how much he likes to help and comfort us. You can't keep treating him like this when he's done nothing wrong, Pan. You're right. I think I am being a little mean. Of course you can come with us if you'd like, Black Crow. <laughs> Oh, together then! <laughs> <laughs> oh, there are so many pins here! Hold the magnet over them, Pissy! There are some here, and here, and here, I and here too! Aye. Look, all the pins have stuck to the magnet! Brother, brother! <laughs> what are we gonna do about the pins? Oh, where are the they pins? They are here, Pin, look! <gasps> but how did you manage? Of course, with the magnet! <laughs> what did Pissy learn about today? Glasses? A magnet? Or a thermos? <laughs> Correct! A magnet! You're wonderful! Now get a piece of paper and pencil and draw your very own wonderful magnet!